okay. I don't even know what to say. Um, so I have wet hair because I literally have a class in 20 minutes, but I really wanted to make this video. Oh my god, you made it too. And I'm just so happy because after practice today, um, we had a 5.45 a.m. practice today. And after practice, um, I got to talk to coach and plain and simple, like I made I made the team, I guess. <laughs> like, oh my God! <laughs> that's Ophelia in the back. She's sick, so she's not in the frame right now, but she's super excited, obviously. <laughs> and um yeah. Um I, I I'm like honestly speechless because like I've dreamt about this since I fell in love with basketball, which was not too long ago. Like I used to hate basketball and I fell in love with it. And at the moment I fell in love with it, I knew that I I didn't know what I would do if I stopped playing. And so the fact that coach said she would love to let, have me join the squad as a roster player, like I literally had to try so hard to contain myself and not just like burst out and like jump around and just be happy. Because even though I was a walk-on, and yes, I probably won't play a whole bunch of minutes because there's 10 other girls on the team who have been recruited or been playing for years, It that part doesn't matter to me. Like, the most important part to me is just that I made, I made the roster. And I still get to play the game that I love every single day for the next maybe four or five months. For the next four years of my college career and I literally I could not have gotten here without the girls on the team now who kept supporting me and kept telling me to believe in myself and just keep pushing through all the weightlifting and the conditioning to make it to this first practice so that I could do my best and you know make the team and also my coaches back home who pushed me, who told me that I I could do it if I worked hard enough. Um, my family, who, you know, after I sprained my MCL in May, um, my parents literally asked me to just not, to stop playing. And I told them I couldn't. Like, I, I literally told them, I said, no. Like, I know that my, my knees are not the greatest of shape right now, but I have to keep playing. And... Um, if you guys have watched my previous videos, you know I did a volleyball tryout in August, and I at that moment when I didn't make the team, I knew that there was something else out there for me, and this is it, and I'm so excited, I'm so happy to be able to consider myself a college student athlete, um, to just have made it here and to have found friends like my roommate and like my teammates and some other people who... I like can't all explain their relationships to me, but they've just really helped me make it to this first practice and they're gonna help me to keep going. And so that's all I have to say. Um, for anybody else who's looking to do walk-on tryouts or who are in the process of doing walk-out tryouts, I wish you guys the best of luck. Just um, keep pushing through. And if you guys have any questions, um, send them my way and hopefully I can make a video to clear those up but yeah it's just it's so happy to be able to finally say I am on the Pacific Lutheran women's basketball team so yeah I hope everyone has a great Tuesday and I gotta run class so bye